All right, guys, it's been a long time since I've been back on the Archibald C set here. We have a couple different things going on. I got some nice little red letters, courtesy of Visual and Archibald X She. Um, it's pretty nice. I like it a lot. Uh, and we also got these cool figurines. Uh, hopefully, videos about that soon. I don't know. I'm thinking about painting my Nilius statue as a Chaos Nilius because uh, that's like my favorite Bakugan right now. Besides Trox, which I also have Trox, but he's already green, so I don't have to do anything about that. But today we do have a opening. Uh, I haven't done one of these in a while, um, but this thing is really cool. It's the Darkest Kellyon set, uh, which comes with a couple cool things. The Pyrus Pegatrix isn't something I'm necessarily excited about, but the Chaos uh, Hydronoid is. So. Uh, we're going to check that out. I'm going to roll the intro, which you haven't heard in a while, so I hope you really, really enjoy it. Get prepared to rock out, and I'll see you on the table. See you. All right, guys, we're back, and uh, I haven't done an opening in a while, so this should be fun. Uh, but like I said, I'm really here for this Darkest Kellyon. Uh, it's a new mold, uh, a brand new Bakugan for me. I haven't gotten any of this wave stuff. I've been kind of holding back uh, just to see if anything's really playable or anything like that. And uh, we'll talk about the Kelly on uh, to really see. I think the cat might touch the camera here in a second. But I'm going to open this up and uh, kind of like we normally do and show everything off. So I'll see you guys there. All right, got this thing open. And um, we're just going to go ahead and go through this uh, Pyrus Pegatrix because we've seen it before. Um, this feels like a good model. That's FWS. Is that the good one? That's the bad one? Alright, well, never mind. It feels good, though. Feel it. It feels pretty cool. Uh, anyway, uh, Pyrus Pegatrix comes with a Magic Shield and a Green Fist. Uh, 300B and 4 Attack. Uh, I don't know if we've really ever used it before. Is it good? What? It's got like an Evo that's something, right? This? Yeah. Uh, it's alright. Yeah, it's something. Anyway, you get a Magic Shield out of it with a 600B Magic Shield, which is pretty cool. Comes with Wreathed and Flame. Uh, these are all AOA cards, so if you haven't seen any of those yet, uh, I have a box opening on my channel. Go check that out. Uh, but this is uh, five damage for two. So for my Descendius people, that might be cool. Uh, might Mac people anyway. Uh, let's go into Chaos Hydronoid Core. Um, if you haven't seen, I have a uh, special diamond opening of a diamond hydronoid uh, on the channel. Uh, so this is not my first, and my first one was a bit of an experience. So uh, this one is really cool though. Uh, I love the Chaos coloration, this and like Chaos Nilius. I'll, uh, look really awesome. Um, I really like the back of him because he has all that design on him. But, but oh, oh, oh god, no. They're going to call me out for it again. <laughs> Are you a Baku abuser? Mm -hmm. there, there's treatment for that. Okay. Okay. I don't want it. You don't want it? Mm -mm. You just want to keep doing that. <laughs> anyway, uh, 400B, uh, two damage for a red shield and a green fist. That's an interesting combination. But domination, if your Bakugan are holding the most Baku cores, that is plus four damage. Uh, so that's kind of cool. You can get up to like six damage on that. Uh, it's kind of kind of weak in the B power range. So I don't know how good it is exactly. Um, and a lot of stuff from this wave isn't exactly the best. Uh, he kind of has like a skull on his chest. That's kind of cool. If you can see that. I really like that. That's pretty neat. Um, he comes with Chaos Laser. A 4 cost for 800B. Uh, pretty normal Chaos card. Big B power for, you know, somewhat of a cost. Uh, so, I don't know if that card's that great. 800. I mean, that's just um, Tangle Vines for Ventus, but without the reroll. So, no, it well, it's minus. minus. Same principle. Anyway, uh, anyway, let's get into the main event here. The Darkest Kellyon Ultra. Uh, this is my first Kellyon. There's a Pyrus one that's going to come out. Uh, I think we know of a Chaos one. Uh, and a couple others, maybe. Um, nope. But it doesn't say. Just Pyrus, Darkest, and Diamond. Pyrus, Darkest, and Diamond? I thought I saw, I saw a Chaos one. Anyway, uh, here we are. This thing is really cool looking. It's like a... Um, Every time I see Kel Kellyon, I think about Keldeo from Pokemon. It's like a little horse thing, but it's it's it comes from a... There's like a mythical creature. I forgot what it's called. I'll look it up. But anyway, um, it's like a horse dragon thing. I don't know what you would really call it, uh, but he's really cool. It's got... You can see the uh, spring in his little me mechanism there. It's kind of neat to see that in action. Uh, he's got like his big shield. I think that's where the core goes. 
yeah so it of course sticks there so he kind of shows it to you when he opens up that's pretty neat uh, i'm interested to see if he like lands on his feet a lot because this is like our first really good looking uh like quadrupedal thing i mean hydras is there but like he has like little wings that like he <laughs> he stands like this uh so this is actually kind of cool so i'm interested to see uh, another one i'm interested to see is like truncaneus uh which they did have but i didn't pick up because i don't know i might want a different one but i'm, I'm probably gonna go back and get it <laughs> anyway um so yeah good look at him here these little flappies kind of stay in and when he opens he actually his horns don't come out they're they're, they're manual so he actually comes out like this which is kind of derpy it's like he's scared like his little dog ears are folded over his face like he's scared um but he's still pretty cool bakugan uh i don't know about folding them up i guess we can try um i already did that together that oh he's just a whole half in one go oh okay cool kind of hydra c oh that was really easy interesting cool let's see how he rolls uh this will be my first roll with a kelly on that's pretty neat let's see give myself a good chance here all right, rolling forward to make sure I'm doing what they're asking me to do. And, okay. First video back on the table, guys. Here we go. Nope, it didn't land on his feet. Let's try it one more time. Backwards. Uh, oh, backwards. See if he picks up two, which I don't think he can. It's going to be really hard to do. We'll see. See if he can pick up two. Normally rolling these ultras backwards does that for you. So let's try it. Do, 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 do. Kind of, he's kind of, um, he's kind of loose. Like you can hear here. <laughs> he's kind of got like a little key jangle to him, so he's kind of loose. But we'll see. Uh, okay, backwards this time. You know why? Huh? Because the FWS. Oh yeah, I guess they all are. Nope. Wow. I'm also trying not to hit my camera tripod, which is right there. Oh, he might be able to pick up two. Yeah. That's. He's a skipper. Yeah, he jumps up a little bit. Okay, that has potential for a two. I'll give it one more, because I kind of want to see it happen, to be honest with you. Uh, but, um, playability-wise, this Kellyon Ultra is very reminiscent of Chaos Pegatrix Core, uh, because, I guess I didn't even read that part out. Uh, he's double green fist, 303. Uh, but if he lands on the green fist, he gets 300B and two attack. So he gets up to, like, what, like seven-something on a good fist. So, um... Yeah, it's a little diminished from Hayos Peg. You play him. What does Hayos Peg get to? 750. Like, that's what that gets to. Yeah, so it's the same thing? I think it's 800. Okay, cool. So, I mean, they're relatively the same. So, uh, if you're looking for a darkest partner, that's why I got this to see. I don't think we have Evos for this. Look it up real quick because I don't really remember. Uh, let me try this roll real quick. I want to see him pick up two. Sorry, there's a bend in my table. Yeah, I don't know about that one. But, he's really cool, man. I really like this model. Get his horns out there. One more time. And full shield. Little wings there. They're really cool. Really opens them up. Um, but uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if there are Evos or anything, which I doubt, um, I will be able to put them up on the screen for you so you can see. Uh, I'm a little bit out of the game a little bit right now. Uh, not knowing exactly what's what uh, because a lot of stuff came out with AOA and this new like line of toys that this stuff came out with. And I'm not exactly caught up yet, but y'all know I've been talking to y'all about my situation and everything. So I appreciate y'all sticking around. Um, and uh, I hope I have cool stuff coming out for the channel. Oh, there is a Evo Darkest Hyper Kellyon Ultra, which gets it to uh, 700B and seven damage, which gives you a bonus if you land on the Green Fist of 500 and plus four, which is actually pretty cool. So what, is, what would that get you to five? Uh, uh, 1350. Like 13, so that's a pretty stout Bakugan, 13, and it's only a four cost. So 13, is, Pe 50, is Pe Titan Pegatrix four cost? Yes. Yeah. So I don't know. It's kind of like the darkest mirror of Chaos Pegatrix. That could be a video. Ooh, <laughs> coming soon. Anyway, uh, like I was saying, thank you guys for watching. Appreciate y'all sticking around through all my like turmoil and busyness in my life. But uh, I'm gonna. I'm going to figure it out as soon as uh, football season and stuff's over. Uh, it'll be a lot easier for me to do this. So I appreciate you guys again. And uh, I will see you guys next time in the next video. And my cat is laying on the trash. And she's really cute. So <laughs> there you go.
in the video on that. See you guys later. Bye.